Hey guys, welcome back. Today I'm uh, checking out the new update for iRacing with the CV1 support finally, so that's really nice. And uh, yeah, right away when I put it on the first time, it's it's so much more clear image. It's ridiculous how much more clear it is than the DK2. And it's way better than the Set Corsa as well in my opinion. It's so you have so much better visibility for some reason in the distance as well and the mirrors are really clear as well. It's like if I'm looking at a normal monitor screen actually. Well, it's not quite there yet, but it's getting really close. And I mean the screen door effect is still there, but it's so minor if you're racing for a bit or driving for a bit, you don't even notice it anymore. And yeah, and yeah as I said before on the set of course video I made, it's the CV1 is so much more smooth with the head tracking and with uh, the refresh rate on 90 instead of 75, it helps a lot as well. Um, what else? So I changed some settings already in iRacing itself. Uh, you have an option to set the pixel ratio like in the debug tool for the Oculus Rift. So I put that to 150%, so that's like 1.5 in the debug tool, which helps with uh, anti-aliasing. I would still like that a little bit better, but I didn't really see any difference putting it much higher, so I'm keeping it on at 150 to not uh, uh, decrease frame rate too much. Actually, I, I turned off the limit on the frame rates, but it keeps capping on 90 frames anyway, so I think that's a Oculus Rift setting or something maybe, I have to look into that. Um, yeah, I just wanted to give a quick update, the, they're still pro in progress of updating the iRacing service itself, so I'll have to wait for that before I can do any actual races, I'm testing in the offline mode right now, and um, let's see, yeah, if the servers are back online, I'll uh, I'll do a race on Imola as well. I couldn't select that in the test drive option yet. And I think they're doing Formula Renault races on there. So um, yeah, I'll check that out later tonight. Um, just a quick update. So uh, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.